okay, I'm starting over because I was talking about cards and I talked about a town where somebody was from and I don't think they want, I don't know if they want people to know what town they're from, so I'm starting over. Happy Monday! As some of you may or may not have noticed, I was not around yesterday. I was here doing nothing, but I wasn't on here doing nothing. But now I'm on here doing nothing. How are you going to come say hello? Susan Kim 51 always likes to see you. Yes, she does. Hey, hey, hey. Come here. Oh, oh you going to rub on the mommy's arm? Oh. She's abused, people. Okay, let's. Yeah. What are you gonna, What are you doing back there? Huh? Oh, coming back. Say hi. There's a dose of the kitte. Um, I wished I would have had my flip cam this morning when I went to work because the weather here is frightful. And not in a fun, good way. We spun out this morning. Dad rode with me and um, we, he had the car warmed up. Because my dad's the best. And we, I drove and we were driving downtown. And I'm going around the curve very slow. Not the curve, the corner. And my back end just kept on floating. So I'm like, whee. And finally we got to a, a stop. And we were pointed the same direction we just came back from. So then I just backed up a little bit and turned and got back on the road. There wasn't any traffic around. So that's just the key. Don't panic, people. You just can't panic. That gets people in more accidents than anything. So I got to work, and um, Dad shoveled in front of the door, and we found where the salt was. I called my office manager and asked her, because apparently she's on vacation this week. I had no idea. So that kind of threw my game plan. I had, to, I, I had to go from doing my job to what else do I have to do? <laughs> um... So that was fun. Um, we got about seven or eight inches of snow today. The town next to us, five miles that way, they only got three or four inches. Now west of us, they got 16 inches of us. We are very lucky, but it won't last for long. Something else is going to come. It's supposed to be crappy again tomorrow. I want to take my camera with me tomorrow. So watch it not be like it was this morning, because this morning, as I'm driving, I'm like, I wish I had my camera. Because it was, I was driving a winter wonderland. Okay, cards, cards, cards. All right, this is from the Wacky family. It's been in my car like a week, and I keep forgetting to bring it in. Thank you, Peggy and Solomon and TJ and everybody. Look at the little snowman. This is from Raven Rose 666 She lives in my general area. I have never met her, and I'm like, what's the name? Because uh, the address, I'm like, where, where, who do I know in that town? And then it was her, Raven Rose 666. I haven't seen her around lately, but thank you very much, lady. That's a cute little fat Santa right there. Um, Johnny Shanks, JC Shanks. Johnny, look at the precious card you sent. Thank you, Johnny. And I'm so sorry. I heard about your doggy. Lizzie told me not long ago. I'm so sorry. He, his doggy passed there. So sad. This is from South301976, Ryan and Misty. Who I met at South Tube. Who doesn't like a little Winnie the Pooh and Piglet, too? Thank you, guys. Gigi has the cutest little card. Thank you, Gigi. That's the cutest little card. It's only missing one word that would make it, two words that would make it the best. This has love, joy, peace, hope, goodwill, kindness, friendship, unity. It needs to say believe and dream on there. Then it'll be the perfect card. And she wrote a nice little note. Thank you, Gigi. And this came from Stefan. And Louie, for me, wish you weren't so far away. I wish we could have got to meet him. I was going to stop and see him on the way home from South, too, but I couldn't get a hold of him. It would have been so nice to have met Stefan and Louie. Maybe sometime. Maybe sometime, Stefan. 
But then Louie. Louie is his wiener dog. He's a smooth-haired wiener dog. And I think Louie has a crush on Heidi Ho because he sent Heidi a Christmas card. And inside he wrote, To Heidi, the most beautiful dog in the world. Look at that. Doesn't that dog have really good penmanship? It's the most wonderful time of the year. I love you, Louie. Look, look at Louie's signature. I showed Heidi. She even stopped and looked at the card. The cat wants out now because I have the door shut. If the door wasn't shut, she would not care. But thank you, everybody. I'm putting them in the stack over here until I get my tape out and tape them to the door. I'm kind of waiting until I get more. That way I can tape a lot of them up at one time. That's my excuse, and I'm sticking to it. And then in the mail today, I also got this, which I got online and sent for Jiffy Mix Recipes. It's actually got a lot of recipes in here. It was a giveaway, and there's all kinds of cookies and cakes and desserts, and there's even some other kind of things in the back, like Kitty, I'm going to kill you. Yep, that's in here. Um, I want to make some Johnny Cakes. Um, Reuben Wedge tells you how to make like a Reuben type pizza, which sounds kind of odd, but it could be good. But there's all kinds of stuff in here. Quiche, Mexican corn bake, breakfast pizzas. So I can't even remember how I, how I got this. I remember going online, but I don't even know where I went to get it. But I'm going to make some out of here someday. Um... It's about 6.30. We just got done having dinner. When I got home from work, I did some pride work here. Oh. Heidi's, Heidi's giving Dad hell. She wants to go out. So I think Dad's going to be going out now. During the winter time, we're, he's taking her out front because he nailed the back door shut to keep a draft from coming in. He just went out and nailed it. So, uh... Because it's an old wooden door, and if it's not shut really tight, a draft comes through, and it's really freaking cold. It's supposed to get down to two degrees. Two! Mm. With the wind chill negative, I don't know, whatever. I'm not impressed by those numbers. Not at all. So, yeah, um... I'll be working tomorrow. I don't know when when else I have to work for, during the week because I don't know me and the graphics person have talked tomorrow about who's covering what days during the rest of the week. Since we didn't know the office manager was on vacation, we're kind of like, what day are you covering? What day are you covering? So, And I hope my boss does not try to drive here from Chicago tomorrow because it's just a bad... It'd be stupid. It'd be a stupid thing. He needs overnight paychecks. I, I'm going to tell Daylene, during the winter time, he just needs to leave enough checks in his drawer to cover if he ever has to miss a payroll week because of weather. Because in the winter, you just do not know what's going to happen here. You don't know what's going to happen. Okay. I had to bitch for a minute. Dad had to go see his sister, the crazy aunt, today because she... Her electric was going to get shut off because she couldn't pay her bill. So he went and helped her out. And her son, Ronnie, my business partner, is supposed to pay my dad back. I don't think Ronnie knows that, but Ronnie, Jenny told my dad, Ronnie will pay you back. Uh, what else do I have to say, people? What am I missing? Apparently, let's go to the bad news now. Because, you know, someone's always getting killed or something around here. Because, you know, I live in the high crime area, which I really don't. But this seems like someone's always dying around here. Kitty cat. Hey, over here. Come here. Hey. Come here. Coming. Um... My aunt and uncle live in Galeen, which is the town over from me. Little, little teeny tiny town. Where the Legion is that I go to. And across the street from them, a man lives. 
He lives alone. His wife passed away a few years ago, and the man drinks a lot. So much so that he's not allowed to drive anymore. And so, are you smelling your treat container? What is this? I'm going to beat you with it. Pow, 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 pow. Giant kitty head. Um, he was walking Sunday, Saturday night uh, after he had been drinking. He's walking alongside the road, minding his own business, and someone hit and killed him. I have yet to hear if the person who hit him stayed there, if they hit him and left, or if the person who hit him was drunk, or I had, had not heard any more. I just thought he was hit and killed. So it's kind of odd. What else happened this weekend I was going to tell you about? I guess nothing. Oh, they're closing two factories around here. One is a big warehouse, 600 people are going to be losing their jobs, and another one is Bendix, um, and another few hundred people are going to be losing their jobs there. So this holiday season is not really nice for about a thousand families. 900 families. Yeah. Now then, Dad's back from letting the Heidi hoe out. Good thing about this weather, Heidi pees very quickly. In the summer, she'll go out there and wander around and look at the, look up in the sky and look and smell the grass. When she goes out, when it's like 12 degrees outside, run pee in. She does not mess around. Just thought you'd like to know that tidbit of information. Yeah. Um, I'm just done. Now I'm done. Bye, everybody. Thanks, everyone, for the Christmas cards. I'm sure you'll be seeing more because, you know, this time of year we're all showing our cards because we have to give thanks to those people who took their times to send us cards. Okay, bye.